Should we do like a we're back? Oh, please no. We're back! Oh, God. Every... What's up, you guys? Uh... I'm 35, <laughs> and I'm trying to relate to 14 year olds, so my voice sounds like this. Like... Let's just be cool. Can we be cool? Be cool? We're a couple cool guys. Okay. Let's just be we... a couple cool guys. We are back. Okay. We should try to avoid saying, hey, guys. And we're back. Yeah. Okay. Like that would be a thing. But we are back. Well, yeah, I know we're back. <laughs> But like maybe we just like introduce ourselves or something. Hey, I'm Anton Millstone. When I came home from work two weeks ago to find a guy railing my girlfriend like there was no tomorrow on my couch. I'm Jay Wells Lequier. Fuck you, marbles. More like the balls that your dog has. And if you're watching this video, it means that you are one of the 6,000 or so subscribers that stuck around hoping one day YouTube Comment Theater would return. Thank you so much for waiting. It was not intended for our hiatus to last seven full years. No. Uh, so again, if you are here, then we do really thank you for being here. Here's a little mini history of, of what happened. We're actually just comedians from Toronto, Canada. Indeed. And in September of 2012, I walked up to my buddy Jay here mm -hmm. and said, yo man, we're gonna move to New York City in January. Yeah. To which he said, oh f yeah, bud. Right. That's a very Canadian response. Oh f yeah, yeah there, bud. Oh f Oh, buddy, buddy, yeah. no question, guy. So we threw out everything we owned. We uh, packed a bag full of clothes, got rid of our apartments, saved mm -hmm. no money, and in January of 2013, we moved to New York City. Yeah, I feel like most immigrant stories are, I came to this country with twenty dollars in my pocket. But our particular immigrant story was, I came to this country with twenty thousand dollars in debt. We started shooting a shit ton of YouTube content with our other good Canadian buddy, Tim Dorsch, mm -hmm. who you might remember from the original videos from his epic portrayal of Mr. Blister 27. My erection is unrivaled in sheer rock solidness. It could choke a donkey. Ugh! Isn't that scary? Do you remember those? Those were fun. That guy is disturbed. <laughs> and so after like three months of releasing videos and the place that we were shooting at not being available anymore, we just had to like put the channel on hiatus so that we could start working, making some money. Oh yeah. Living like adults yeah. and not 18 year old psychos sleeping on a floor. There were four of us living in a one bedroom apartment in Brooklyn. A this mouse infested, roach infested. <sighs> utter hellhole. The pipes exploded in the kitchen ceiling and just spouted brown, black, sludgy shit water. There was a full like 10 kitchen. days where the water didn't work. Yeah. So in order to flush the toilet, we had to go down to the deli next door with a bucket, yeah. fill it up with water, pour it into the back of the toilet. Well, we'd let the bucket just to be fill up with flush. the black sludge water that was coming in from the ceiling. That was a good move. For a quick second, switch out the bucket to then dump in the back of the toilet to flush our own down the toilet. <laughs> Things were that not was a great. Big graphic. One you time I got woken up by a mouse crawling up my actual pajama pants on my leg. That was probably the lowest point for me. Mine was two roaches on my chest mm. in my like chest hair that I like took my blanket off and looked down. I had to like swat them across the room. Before we go any further, we should mention that Tim and Dez, we showed a clip of Tim earlier. Here's a little clip of Dez. Tell it to me straight. Why do you hate Drake and not Rick Ross? And what's the difference between them? Those two are actually married. And they've also since had a baby and moved back to Canada. Healthcare. You know. So they actually won't be involved in the relaunch of this channel, but we are forever grateful to them for getting this thing going in the bless, first place. Bless you. Mm. A lot has happened in the last seven years. We got our own apartment. We went on an Ikea run. Yeah. We went on Tinder, started dating girls again. We got married. Hello. Met my wife on Tinder. This it can happen. A, this guy's about to it have a baby yeah. any day now. Yeah. In fact, by the time Depending this gets released, when this is out, yeah. you might have I'll a child already. Have, it's a boy. Hey. I'll raise him up good and non-toxic too, I promise. Mainly uh, in these last seven years, what we've been up to is live comedy as the duo Jay and Aton. Hey now. But all through this very extended and unintended seven year hiatus, every once in a while, we'd be like, man, we gotta start YouTube comment theater up again. It's really <laughs> stupid to stop. It was stupid. It was stupid to stop. And then last July, I was hanging out with our good buddy Nathan McIntosh, a, a fantastic New York City comedian, also from the original videos. And believe me when I say, I'm the English Jesus. And he joked with me that, man, if we just kept YouTube comment theater going, we'd all be on Ellen by now. Hmm. Might be a bit filthy. Maybe for a Ellen, bit much for Ellen, but we got time. the point. I mean, yeah. we got the point. And funnily enough, yeah. it was that one harmless comment that kind of kick the wheels back in motion to get yeah. this relaunch happening. Even long after we went on hiatus, there were still people enjoying the videos, wanting the videos to happen. Thank you. Thank you. We wouldn't be here. 
It makes it easier that. for us to then say, like, let's get it going again. One of the best things that's happened to us uh, in, in this time off is that we've met some incredibly talented filmmakers along the way. Yeah. Most notably our good buddy, Dan Bricker. There he is. Another Canadian sitting next to camera right now. Yeah. I uh, hate being on camera. Cool. Dan has been our absolute hero directing the hell out of these videos, making them look fantastic. Bless. So if you haven't figured out by now, based on everything that we've been saying, we're back. We're back. Next Tuesday, YouTube Comment Theater is officially relaunching. Uh. And here is a quick little trailer of what's to come. Hot robot. You thinking a machines is hot? I find disturbing. Damn, boy, she thick! She thick! Like, if he hadn't murdered all those people, he'd be a cool-ass guy. Let the insults fly. You're so brainwashed! Communist! Millennial! Jerk! Stupid, you idiot! Gay SMF. Depressed, fat, basement-dwelling, desperate, sexually frustrated neckbeard. Stupid ass bitch! IDC if people think I'm ugly. Try to be less autistic next time, mate. He killed 36 people. Yo, Ryan, it's too I was there with you when you were smashing your girl away as I was in the living room watching African movies. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not stupid or anything. It's just that I'm only 12 and I don't research about these topics much. Then why are talking? A man can't even hang out and get to know someone new over pizza? Suck. I was under their bed masturbating. Donkey! I was spapping in the closet. Ah! Swear! I dare you! Call me on! Yes! <laughs> are you excited? Yeah. We are. <laughs> oh, are you asking me or them? I'm yes, at, well, I'm they're, asking they're excited? Them. I'm are they excited? At, I'm, I'm looking are you excited? Looking at them. I don't know, I'm excited. I'm sick of talking to you. Okay. I'm, I want to talk to them. Okay, talk to them. Tuesday, mark it on your calendar.